was actually speechless. He's a piggy. I love I that. Love it's so quick. Go on, Adam. <laughs> Adam, you look gorgeous. How are you feeling? I'm feeling nervous. Eating weird flavoured jelly beans. Donuts. This is Neil, our team leader. <laughs> Bye. Hi, I'm Adam, and this is my Draw My Life. I was born in a small city called Derry in Northern Ireland in October 1999. What a long time ago. And I still live there with my mum, dad, my little brother Callum, and our dog, Bailey. <laughs> At school, I was head boy at St. Collins College. I got 11 A stars at GCSE. People are always surprised when I tell them that. They might also be surprised to know that I can moonwalk. Yep, that's a fact. Ever since I was little, I've loved making videos with my friends. I used to use an ancient phone and spend hours watching tutorials on how to edit them. My classmates always made fun of me for spending so much time on them. But my mom always said that it takes real guts to continue doing what you love, even if people are laughing at you. Me and my younger brother Callum started doing films and silly things like making our own drone and eating weird flavoured jelly beans, but it soon evolved into pranks. I auditioned for Blue Peter not expecting anything, but when I was told I was going to be the 40th presenter, I was actually speechless. I mean, I literally couldn't speak. Since getting the job, I've had to move to Salford part-time. I feel like I've finally grown up, doing my own cooking, cleaning, washing up. I really miss my family, but the other presenters are really nice, and to be honest, you can't complain too much when your job is jumping into slime baths and breaking world records. It's an actual dream come true. And every week, I look around the BP studio and have to pinch myself just to remind me that it's real. What is your first tip to make Henry behave better in studio? Well, the first exercise you could do would be just to make sure that he's focused on you. Just make sure that his eyes follow the treat wherever it goes. Ah, uh, OK. That is focus, all right. So once you got his attention, is that when you give him the treat? Yes, that's just to begin with. You want the interest to come off the treat and onto you. So you hold it out and just hold a little way. But as soon as he makes eye contact with you, yeah. you reward him, make sure that he knows that that was the right thing to do. Got it, okay. Henry, look, Henry, look. Oh, I have a treat, I have a treat, okay. Right, stay still. No, 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 no. I, I, no, I don't want your hands. I don't want your hands. Right, look, I have a bit of food. I have a treat, okay? Okay, treats certainly get Henry's attention. No, look at me. Hey, good boy. We mastered that one. What is tip number two? The second one is a hand touch. Hand touch, okay. Which is where if he wanders off while you're trying to do a piece to camera. Yep, this one could definitely help. Please, Whoa, sorry. Henry, no. You put your hand down and hopefully he should touch his nose onto it. Holding a treat in the middle of my palm and holding your thumb over it with the rest right. of your fingers stretched out. Then hopefully he should come and touch his nose onto it because of the treat there. Right, okay. He's snuffing it out. Let's see if he goes for it. Oh, he's slowly hey. creeping. He's slowly That's creeping. It. Good boy. There we go. So you put it under, under your thumb like under that? Under your thumb and hold it in the middle of your palm. OK. So, Henry, do you spot that? Oh, 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 oh. Way. Good boy. And we keep doing that until eventually we have no treat in our hand? Yes. OK. Does he know that there's no treat here? Oh, <gasps> good boy. There we go. So we did it. We have to reward him for still doing the action. I'm super proud of Henry. He's, he's, he's learning all the tips that we're teaching him. Um, and what is your third and final tip, Taylor? The final one is an exercise where we try and teach him to stay in a certain place. Okay. For this, we normally use a mat. You'd lay it on the floor or on the sofa, depending on where you want him, and you would hope that he would stay there until he's allowed to come off. So, we get the mat down. Okay. And then you want to just reward him for any feet on the mat. So, Henry, on the mat, on the mat, sit, sit. Good boy, good boy. Yes, we did it, we did it. Taylor, we did it. You are an amazing teacher, well done.
Henry and I haven't wasted any time trying to practice what Taylor taught us. Every moment we can get when filming in the studio, I'm trying to improve our bond and get him to stay still. But it has been tough. Look at me. Good boy. <laughs> That's a good boy. At the moment, Henry is definitely still the one in control. Henry, 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 Henry. Oh, thank you, Taylor, for all of those dog training techniques. Let's try it with Henry, shall we? Henry, look. We'll try the hand technique. Look, you coming? Come here. Come on, touch my hand. Oh, 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 oh. I have to take part in this exercise, but I don't know what this exercise actually is. Maybe I can be at the bottom helping the guys come down the cliff, you know, because that would be cool. But yeah, I don't think I'll be, I won't be going down any cliffs today. <laughs> no chance. Uh, hang on, Kerry. We seem to be climbing higher up this cliff, not lower. Wow, this is, this is high end. Oh, look at this fella, he looks like he needs some help. I better mm. let you guys do your magic. Not exactly, Adam. You're gonna be helping us lower him down on this stretcher, down that crag. That's what they think. Um, that. This is Neil, our team leader. <laughs> Bye. Come back. Come back, my friend. We always make trainees do an awful lot of training before they're on call outs. So you're gonna walk a few miles in their shoes and you're gonna lower Fred down that cliff on the stretcher. Okay. You're going to be attached to the stretcher, you're going to be perfectly safe. Just to be clear, I'm going down there? Absolutely. Okay, let's, let's do this. I'm joining the team today wearing masks and protective gear, keeping as much distance whenever possible. Having got all the equipment up here, they're letting me help get Fred the dummy down the cliff. There's definitely no chance of this unraveling and... Absolutely not. No? The mountain rescue team frequently test out their techniques at this site for training, as fixed anchor points have been placed deep into the ground. So, are you ready to go? Yes, I think I'm ready. Good man. The first few steps are often the hardest part of being lowered in abseiling because you're leaving the horizontal cliff top for the vertical cliff face. I'm gonna bring the stretcher over and you're gonna pull it out. Just lean out, lean backwards, keep your legs far apart and flat on the face. Okay. Okay? Yeah. So just lean back. Just lean back, keep your legs apart. Whoa! Hold on. Whoa! I think nervous is an understatement right now. Right, guys, I'm, I'm making my way down. I have to try and keep flat. That's it. Whoa! Right, nice and flat. Whoa! Okay, come on, Fred. Come on. Okay. Okay. Whew. Sorry about the rough ride, Fred. I'm sure the experts handle patients with far more care. Oh, guys, that height. Whoa. I didn't think I could do this at first, but my confidence is growing with every step. Here we go. Perfect. Okay, I think I've got the hang of it. Probably because the groin is getting closer. Okay, down. Oh, so scary. Woo! I think I've mastered this. Down. Woohoo! My feet are on the ground. Oh, my feet are on the ground. Woo! Well done. <laughs> that was scary, but you know what? The first few steps were the scariest. Everything else after that was a breeze. Or at least that's what I tell myself. Wow, that's a long way up. So the record he's setting for is the most table tennis balls bounced and caught in shaving form on the head in 30 seconds by an individual. What? OK, it's a catchy title. It is. <laughs> and um, how many does he need today? He needs a minimum of 10. OK, Prav, that's a bit mean. He's only got 30 seconds. Should we make it five? No, we no. have a standard. To keep. That's absolutely, I respect that. So let's get on to the rules, because there's quite a lot of them. So here we go, these are the main ones. The balls have to be bounced off a wall before being caught on Adam's head. The distance between the participant, Adam, and the wall must be at least one metre, and the balls have to last on the head, this is mean, for at least five seconds after the record attempt is over. So let's bring in Adam, come on in, looking a bit like a character from The Simpsons or something. <laughs> Adam, you look gorgeous. How are you feeling? I'm feeling nervous. Uh, 10 and 30 seconds is quite a lot, but 
I think I can do it. You look like my mum in the 80s. <laughs> right, so take your position there. No offence, Sue. And here we go, Prav. It's over to you, Adam. Good luck. Adam, are you ready for the new Guinness World Records title? Yes. Three, two, one, go. Take your time, Ads. Brilliant, that's already won. Adam, you've got this. You've absolutely got this. He's going slow and steady. A couple bouncing off, but he's already got six. This is looking good. Don't wobble around too much, Az. Just take your time. Maybe more to the left or right. Turn your head if you can a little. Yes, that's really good. Ads, you're so close. That was beautiful. I think you've done it, Ads. Keep going. There you go. Brilliant. OK. We have no idea if he's done that. So five, four, three, two, one. OK. Adam, very, very carefully go down onto your knees and perhaps just going to get some safety gear on so he can actually get close to Adam. I saw at least five go on, but remember, he does need ten. So perhaps just going to have a little look now and count. We honestly, here in the studio, have no idea what's just happened or back. whether he's done it. So lean your head back if you can, Adam. I feel sick. I'm going to oh, vomit. Please. Question please. is, has he done it? Are we ready for the moment of truth, Prav? Let's stand back. Adam, you can stand up. OK, let's have the results. Here we go. So if I can remind you, the minimum was set at 10. Yeah. With a total of 10, oh! you have set a new Guinness World Record title. Oh! World record. How are you feeling? Oh my goodness, what a way to end the show. My very own world record. Adam, where are you? Oh, Get over here. I'm Diggy. right here. His little piggy. Love that. I look so stupid. But Martha clearly said presenters. Yeah. Emphasis on this. Fair. It's plural. So I'm not doing this alone. Lindsay, <coughs> come here. <laughs> here she yet. is. My I'm ready. Chicken. I'm ready. You, you look born ready. Now, the dogs were brilliant at this, both in, especially Henry as well. Um, I'm going to make sure that you two race each other through this dog assault course as fast as you can, but one at a time. And I'm going to time you, and whoever has the fastest time wins. Understand? Yes. Ready? Yes. yes. Lindsay, you can go first. All right, I'm my little chicken. Three, two, one. Go! <laughs> Added sound effects. Oh, my bonus points for the added sound effects. Here she goes. Uh, the wing. There's a, we have a chicken doing the worm. Through I'm gonna the try the What are you doing? Are you okay? I'm on my back. Oh yeah, chicken doing the worm it is. Okay, that's quite something. Wait, we know what in and out. Get in and out, go on, Linz. In and out. You lost your head. In and out. There you go. There you go. In and out, go on, Linz. Nearly there. Nearly there. Stop the drill. Stop the clock! All right, I'm not going to reveal your time yet. I'm going to wait for About Adam to hours. do his... Yes, four days. Okay. Uh, Adam. Right. I was born. You're next. I was ready for this moment. My little piggy, are you ready? I am very ready. Three, two, one. Go, go, go! <laughs> he's doing all fours! Don't like he's doing all fours! <laughs> he's he's in. Oh, he's rapid. He's rapid. <laughs> Adam going on all fours because he's a piggy. I love I that. Mean, it's so quick. Go on, Adam. Go on, Adam. Go on, Adam. In and out. I mean, there's, there's only one winner, isn't there? No. Well done. Stop the clock. Stop the clock. That was... That was brilliant. And the times are here. Now, I understand that Lindsay got 28 seconds and Adam got... 22 seconds. Congratulations, Adam. You are our farmyard champion.